technology of the future. Now we will witness the first biometric system in the world that is able to recognize people by their faces, or so claim the creators of this technology, just like you and I do when we meet each other and easily recognize each other. Let's test the system and see whether it recognizes me and lets me in. Unfortunately, you are not recognized. No, I didn't pass identification. How to pass? Let's go find out. When you approach the device, it illuminates your face with a pattern of light. So it flashes at my face and basically creates a three-dimensional digital copy of it. The invisible pattern, with an accuracy of a fraction of a millimeter, measures the geometry of a human face. An infrared camera photographs the received 3D image, and a computer creates an absolutely exact mathematical model of the face, which serves as the basis for the 3D cask. Put plainly, it's like a Fantamas mask. So, I've been entered into the system, and now want to test it. To do so, I have this curved glass mask, which in principle should refract my image. So, what do you say, system? You have passed identification. It identified me, good. Now I'll test it wearing dark glasses. You have passed identification. Welcome. Now, what if we have twins try it? Let's test it. Here they are. Alina, Karina. Or is it Karina, Alina? One of them is registered in the system. Yes, I am. Who? Me, Alina. Okay, Alina is registered. Alina first, approach the door. You have passed identification. Okay. Karina. Unfortunately, you were not recognized. But I passed identification. Don't try to trick a smart system. Technology of the future.